So this is a liana that's called um, Prionostema aspera, and it's it's really asperus, meaning it's like sandpaper, because it's got all these hairs that are pointed backwards, and it uses those hairs to to grab onto a tree and to hold itself, and then once it hits the tree. The, the vine knows that, it can sense that it's touching something, and what it starts to do is it starts to grow around that thing. So it, what it does is it grows the cells on the outside more than the ones on the inside, and it t starts to curve around the tree. And, and so you can see this one is lost, and it's looking for something, and it's not going to find anything. But its brother over here, they're both coming out of this stem that's going up in the canopy, its brother or sister has gone up and it's actually found a tree and you can see it's wrapped around the tree and it's starting to climb. And it knows when it touches something, it's called a thigno thigmonastic response. And once it touches something, it actually starts to curve around it. And so these plants aren't these inert objects that, that just grow with no plan. They know where they are in space, and they know when they touch something, and they know which way down is, and they know which way up is. And this is a good example of how these things actually find their supports and snake through the forest. Because this one is going up pretty well. The mother stem here is already up in the canopy, and these ones will be too. This one may or may not be, but it's trying.